Head. Headline News Update. Okay, good afternoon, folks. Larry Pesavino for the mid-morning update, and we have stocks have sold off quite a bit from the early morning high. We were up around 34,000 uh, in the Dow Jones E-mini. We're now at uh, 36.9, or excuse me, 33,700. So we've given quite a bit there, over 600 points. We've given back uh, 50 points in the Nas uh, in the S&P. Nasdaq still holding up pretty good. The big surprise has been the crude oil. We made a beautiful 78% retracement this morning, right after the opening, mid-morning here uh, in New York. And by golly, she's rallied about uh, $3 a barrel already, and looks like it's going higher. That's been a big move here. Uh, also, Treasury bonds, I posted a chart of that, and as you can see here, Treasury bonds went right up to the 61% retracement of the October high. Uh, trading at 125, we're now trading at 124. It's down a uh, one full handle from that level, and the euro has given up uh, well over 100 points here, and the British pound has given up more than 200 points here uh, since the market uh, had that early morning bust about uh, uh, an hour and a half ago. Well, two hours ago. So they're having a lot of volatility over here. We're going to cover some of these things, starting with the the Treasury bonds today when we do our regular show here. Um, well, we're, we're going to have a, a no more guests this week. The reason why I'll be, I'm going to be off Thursday and Friday. I'm finally getting this allergy situation uh, contained. Evidently, I have to do, they have to do a tiny bit of, uh, of surgery and not much, but a little. Anyway, they don't want to do anything for a couple days, so I'll be uh, resting for that time. But uh, we're going to have some great markets here. Uh, for the rest of the year and all of next year. We're going to have great volatility. There's so many unknowns in the world, folks, and that yields to volatility, whether it's coming from China, the U.S., Ukraine, doesn't make any difference. Uh, Saudi Arabia, uh, there's going to be great volatility. So hopefully we'll be able to cash in on some of that. You know, we've been bearish bonds and stocks uh, from January through October, and uh, so far that's acted pretty good, and we're ready for phase two of that starting any time now so we'll be watching those things very closely so that's what we're watching here today try to stay tuned for my show uh, Fibonacci 24 7 trade what you see and we'll try to line up some of the things that we're watching we can now send videos instantaneously so we're going to be able to cash in on some of these intraday moves that happen hopefully that'll be uh, be uh, very very helpful to everyone so we'll be right back after a few words of our sponsor 